sorry about that. Hey guys, welcome back to Let's Play Undertale. Um, my microphone was not on. Was like, no! Oh god, I think she can hear me. Don't kill me. You don't see a thing. Go away. Yeah, that's what I thought. Don't mind my voice crack. I will voice crack if I want. I'm out of here. Hmm? Yo, did you see the way she was staring at you? That was awesome. I'm so jealous. She was just standing there waiting forever, and then you just... Come on, let's go watch her beat up some bad guys. I would welcome that right now. Because I'm just trash. 18 left. I killed Papyrus. I killed him. I didn't want to do that, but it just... The guilt. Aaron flexes in. Oh my lord, hello Aaron, how are you? My name is Aaron too. Education. Hobby. Challenge. Sweating bullets. You won! Woo! I know it's over this way. <laughs> Squeak! That's such an adorable sound, just... Squeak! Well, what am I doing? I need to go this way. There's a lone quiche sitting underneath this bench. Will you take it? You got the abandoned quiche. I just wasn't ready for the responsibility. Bling. Oh. Darn spot! Does that say hope on the soap? Ha! <laughs> hope on the soap. Oh god. It's dark. Oh god! <laughs> run, 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 run! Ooh. She'll never find me here. just touched me! I'm never washing my face ever again. Man, are you unlucky. If you were standing just a little bit to the left. Yo, don't worry. I'm sure we'll see her again. <sighs> no doubt. Sixteen left.
I should probably deposit some of my items into the box here. Oh, um... I'll put the quiche in there. I'll keep the monster, monster candy with me, because who knows, I, I might use it. It's hard to say, though. Primarily because of the fact that I have 50-some-odd health. What was it? 52 health. So, odds are the monster candy won't really help me too much. It'll only recover 10 HP, but it's better than nothing. It's a pair of ballet shoes. Will you take it? Yes, I will. You got the ballet shoes. You equip the ballet shoes. A worn pink leather glove for five-fingered folk. Um, let's see. One, two, three, four, five. I have five fingers, so get out of here. Tough glove was thrown away. I should have looked at that earlier. Hmm. I'm the kind of person that doesn't think things through. Frisk and a tutu. Ooh, hello. You walk into Mold's Mall. Burble, burble. I do feel guilty about, you know, killing everybody, but... <sighs> that will all change. I will redeem myself. I will redeem myself. Eventually. I don't know how, but I will. Ah, Mother Murza! Hello, Shiren! What are you looking at? <laughs> I don't have the code off the top of my head. Besides, I don't really need what's behind there anyways. An umbrella. No, nope, I don't need it. I'm a dirty brother killer. I deserve to be covered in rain. Yo! You can't hold an umbrella either? No, I chose not to. You're walking anyway. I guess I'll go with you. <laughs> Let's go! <sighs> Kid, you may want to get away from me. I'm just a murderer. He doesn't care. Man, Undyne is so cool. She beats up bad guys and never loses. If I was a human, I would wet the bed every night. Knowing she was going to beat me up. <laughs> As I said before, I would welcome that right now. But I think she will lose. So, one time, we had a school project where we had to take care of a flower. The king, we had to call him Mr. Dreamer, volunteered to donate his own flowers. He ended up coming to school and teaching the class about responsibility and stuff. That got me thinking. Yo, how cool would it be if Undyne came to school? She could beat up all the teachers! <laughs> um, maybe she wouldn't beat up the teachers. She's too cool to ever hurt an innocent person. <sighs> Apparently not me. That must be my destination over there in the corner. Just keep walking, just keep walking. Yo, this ledge is way too steep. Yo, you want to see Undyne, right? Climb on my shoulders. Okay. Ow! Yo, try being a little less rough. <laughs> anyway, I'll look for another way through. Later! Face plants. Thirteen left. <sighs> I'm just a dirty brother killer, and I hate it. Oh. Oh. Oh, no. Oh, God. 
I'm out of here! Stupid analog! No! <sighs> Holy crap, this is scary! Oh no. Please. Have mercy on me! Oh god! Okay, I deserve this! Woo! It sounds like it came from over here. Oh! You've fallen down, haven't you? Are you okay? Here, get up. Reserves, huh? That's a nice name. My name is... There's golden flowers again. Jeez. Still 13 left. Trash zone. Well, this is where I belong. You rest your hand on the rusted bike. Its horn wheezes a honk of despair. <sighs> it's a cooler. It has no brand and shows no signs of wear. Inside are a couple of freeze-dried space food bars. Take one? Sure. You got the astronaut food. I'll take another one. The cooler is empty. Just like you run away. I'm a ghost that lives inside a dummy! My cousin used to live inside a dummy too. Until you came along. Not only did your actions cause them to leave their home, but now all their neighbors are gone too! Despicable! 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 You're the worst person I've ever met! I've never been more mad! Rah! My mannequin levels are going off the charts! Yurika, Yurika, Yurika! Human, that moment of unbridled emotion. It allowed me to finally fuse with my body. I'm fully corporeal now. My lifelong dream realized. In return, I guess I won't stomp you. How's that sound? Glad Dummy lets you go. Sorry, bud. You're in my way. I feel awful. Seriously. Like, truly, I feel freaking awful about what I'm doing. Use the box? Yeah. Um, I'll put the monster candy in the box there. <laughs> so you came here? What a treat. Don't expect a discount. Um... Good riddance. <sighs> I deserve it. You equip the glasses. Well, normally I can't see without my glasses anyways. I wouldn't buy your shitsy garbage at knife point. <sighs> 
Understandable. I'm a dirty brother killer! Well, nothing there. I'm telling you, I feel absolutely terrible about what I've done. Special enemy Tammy appears here to defeat you. Smack! Sorry, Tammy. That would be me, though. I'd be, like, staying there with my glasses and carrying a notebook, and I'd just smack an enemy across the face with a notebook. <laughs> like, you wanna mess with me? Smack! Smack! <laughs> Like, I literally have a notebook over here, so <laughs> if someone walked in here to, like, tried to grab me, I'd probably smack him in the face with a notebook. <laughs> it's like, no, get away! I have a notebook! Don't make me use it! <laughs> I'm armed! I am armed with the deadly notebook! Cinnamon bonds! Oh my god, I have that cinnamon! I got a paper colleague! Tim, what am I cinnamon? No. <laughs> no. You will regret this. <laughs> Oi! <laughs> I don't want to give her my cinnamon bun, I'm gonna eat it. I'm gonna take the stick though. I'm surprised Tammy is still there after all I've done. It doesn't even matter if I'm giving her this crap or not. Because I can't buy Temi armor or even pay for Temi to go to college. I've, I've killed everyone. There's no point. There is no freaking point. But I'm doing it anyways. I'm selling her my crap because it's in my box and it's driving me bananas! If I'm going to have it, I'm going to get some sort of profit out of it. Ow. Okay, I deserve that. Oh my god. This is just terrible. I... I feel like utter garbage for what I'm doing to these poor monsters. They didn't do anything to me. And here I am just murdering them. What have I become?! Yeah, you continue sweating bullets here, buddy. Ow.
Ow. Just to be certain, I'm going to run up and down this little strip here. Wait, just, there we go. Just got to make sure I've gotten every monster. I take care of Washua. Now for Mulvig. Excuse me. Seven human souls. With the power of seven human souls, our king, King Asgore Dream, will become a god. With that power, Asgore can finally shatter the barrier. He will finally take the surface back from humanity and give them back the suffering and pain that we have endured. Understand, human? This is your only chance at redemption. Give up your soul, or I'll tear it from your body. Nah, I want to hold on to my soul, thank you very much. Undyne! I'll help you fight! Mm -hmm. Thanks, kid. Yo! You did it! Undyne is right in front of you! You got front row seats to her fight! Yeah, no kidding, I'm in the fight, you moron. Wait, who's she fighting? H hey! You aren't gonna tell my parents about this, are you? <laughs> <laughs> yeah, probably, probably little kid. Kid, you may want to get away from me. I'm serious. Get away. Yo, Undyne told me to stay away from you. She said you... you hurt a lot of people. But... Yo, that's not true, right? Y yo why won't you answer me? A and what's with that weird expression? <gasps> Oh, oh man. Man, my heart's pounding right out of my chest. What should, what would Undyne do? Y yo, you better stop right where you are. Because if you want to hurt anyone else, you're, you're going to have to get through me first. A and, and, in my way. Get out of my way! <gasps> Oops. Undyne, you're... you're hurt. Hurt? It's nothing. Next time, listen when I tell you to leave. Okay? Undyne, I... I'll take care of this! Get out of here! Oh my god. <sighs> it's nothing. No. S somehow, with just one hit... I'm already... already... D damn it! Papyrus... Alphys... Asgore... 
just like that. I... I failed you. Ah, uh, now I feel bad. I feel real friggin' bad. Huh? No. My body... It feels like it's splitting apart. Like any instant, I'll scatter it to a million pieces. But... Deep, deep in my soul... There's a burning feeling I can't describe. A burning feeling that won't let me die. This isn't just about monsters anymore, is it? If you get past me, you'll... You'll destroy them all, won't you? Monsters, humans, everyone. Everyone's hopes, everyone's dreams. Vanquished in an instant. But I won't do that. Right now. Everyone in the world. I can feel their hearts beating as one. And we all have one goal. To defeat you. You know whatever you are. For the sake of the whole world. I, Undyne, will strike you down. Uh-oh. I'm scared. Ooh, I should be scared! You're gonna have to try a little harder than that! The heroine appears. Undying the Undying. Spider, spider. My lord! <laughs> Eat the cinnamon bunny! Crap, I can't move! Terrifying. Eat the cinnamon bunny. Run, 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 Stay determined. 
Oh my god! <laughs> okay. Alright, I'm using my keyboard for this. Because um, the analog was really screwing me up during the arrow command. So I'm going to have my controller sitting on my lap for when I'm in red. But when I'm green, I gotta switch to keyboard. Got it. Yo! Hey, buddy. How you doing? Yo, dude. I, I heard some things and... What? Look over here. What for? Boop, boop. Hey, I'm done. How you doing? Hi. Okay, here we go. Cinnamon Bunny, go. Alright, I'm green again. Alright, astronaut food. I am freaking shaking over here. Astronaut food. And I'm red again, so... Right, move. Dang it. Move. 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 Alright. Move. 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 Get out of here. Move, 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 move! Green again. Cinnamon bunny. I don't know how I just did that. That was... What? Whatever. I do deserve it, so... Damn, item. Uh, I have a good item loadout, it's just I'm being STUPID! I'm not doing this right! <sighs> hey, Monster Kid, how you do- <gasps> bup, bup. Okay, let's get this over with. Come on, Undyne! Get out of my way! Okay. Up, 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 da, 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 Ah! The arrow didn't click! This is ridiculous! Come on, Undyne! Wow. 
Bop, bop. on that one. Whoa, okay. Hang on. Woo! Undyne, you're not kicking my ass three times in a row. Come on! Try as you might, it won't happen. Move. Move. Dang it! Item, uh, still peace. She's clipping me. Green again. Spider cider. I played Legend of Dragoon. You really think I can't dodge these? Come on! Ow. I gotta eat my own words whenever I'm battling, because seriously, they're just gonna freaking kill me at this rate. Rotations. Counter the rotation. Counter the rotation. Good. Uh, Cinnamon Bunny, go. close. I was close. I was really freaking close. Oh my lord. Try this again. Come on. Ba -ba. Bam. Alright, alright. Bring it on, Undyne! This is four times I've died to you. Come on! Well, actually three, but this is my fourth time fighting you. Come on, bring it on! I just gotta remember... Ba -ba!
on. I had my own little time delay right there. My brain is not quite functioning this freaking fight! This is RIDICULOUS! Rotations. <sighs> Astronaut food. to take cinnamon bunny Wasn't enough. <laughs> if you if you think I'm gonna give up hope, you're wrong. Cause I've got my friends behind me. Alphys told me she would watch me fight you. And if anything went wrong, she would evacuate everyone. By now, she's called Asgore and told him to absorb the six human souls. And with that power, this world will live on. Can't snap. My hands are sweaty from that fight. I can't snap! <laughs> hey, Mommy, want to snap for me? I can't snap. Come over here and snap. My hands got all sweaty from the fight. I can't snap. <laughs> I've never had my hands get so sweaty from a fight before. <laughs> oh, my lord. Uh, <clears throat> wow. 
All right, let's... There we go! All it took was me dying three times that I could do that. Yay! Forty left. <gasps> Excuse me. Oh. Oh, there you are. You ugly little creature. You've made quite a name for yourself. Such infamy! I'm impressed. Oh, yes. If you're looking for Alfie, she's not here. While you were busy doing your... <clears throat> thing. She was running around evacuating people to safety. Now they are in a place where you'll never get to them. Deciding not to fight you. My, my, she really is the only smart one, isn't she? Oh, how sassy. You're just itching to get your hands on me, aren't you? Well, too bad. This world needs stars more than it needs corpses. Ditto. Toodles. Hmm. With that said, I'm gonna leave this episode here. See you in the next episode!